Yo, Liam, you're back with another episode of Minecraft Survival Games. Today we're playing SG200. We're on the map Survival Games 3 at the moment. But if, um, if you were returning to this video, I'm going to have annotations in the top right corner starting now um, for a couple seconds that you can click on to advance to other games. And there will also be links in the description below if you're on mobile. So, uh, yeah, there are going to be other games there in case um, you need to skip around and stuff. So I'm going to be heading on my route this way. We're on the 48-player version of this map, by the way. Oh, jeez, people are starting to go that way. Can't let that happen. I gotta get to the pyramid first. Okay, so anyway, let's get into it. Um, I've been gone for three and a half weeks, and we gotta cover some stuff. Um, some initial stuff, I'm shirtless this episode. Gotta keep up that tradition, because every 50 uh, episodes, I do a shirtless one, and this one's gonna be an hour-long shirtless extravaganza, so you guys have nothing to worry about. You guys get all my shirtless content, which is good. Ladies, you're welcome. <laughs> um, but anyway, I've actually lost a ton of weight, so my body probably doesn't look as good as it did three and a half weeks ago. But anyway, you guys are probably wondering, where have I been? What have I been doing? Um, oh, jeez, someone already went up there. No, 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 no. That can't happen. They're going to loot my stuff. They're going to loot my stuff. Okay, but anyway. I'm going to try to make... Uh, come on. You serious, bro? Okay, I hate people. I hate people sometimes. And that guy's looting. Why is everybody looting my stuff? I'm not even getting a fighting chance here. Um, so anyway, I'm going to go to this chest in the back here. But anyway, um, I'm going to talk about where I was, what I did. Um, I will say that I, mi I didn't miss playing Minecraft, but I did miss making content for it. Um, I really missed you guys. I'm not going to lie. Just having your comments there and stuff really meant a lot to me. And I'm glad that you guys uh, liked all the pre- Oh, the pre-recordings. You're welcome for those. Those were so- That took so long to make. So you guys, if you enjoyed them, you're welcome for them. You don't even have to say thank you. Just, you're welcome. Because that took a lot of effort to do. And hope it, it paid off. You guys really seemed to like them. And it tied you guys over for three weeks. Especially since I couldn't stream- um, God, are you kidding me? Let me get a chest on my route. The only chest I'm going to be able to grab now is the one on the top of the mountain and maybe a couple over here by the village, which is kind of annoying, but gotta suck it up sometimes. Um, so anyway, and that's a tier two, I think, as well. So, um, there's, there's a tier two near here, by the way, that I gotta look at. So, um, anyway, let me get, here's the tier two. Let me get into, that was decent. Uh, let me get into where I was. So I left on a Thursday evening for a plane to go to do college visits for two or three days. I'm not going to explain, I'm not going to say which colleges I want, am applying to, um, just because for personal reasons, I'll just say that to keep it simple. For personal reasons, I'm not saying where I'm applying, but uh, I'll let you guys know once I do get into certain colleges, which ones I'm thinking about, which ones I'm attending, but I, I need to find out first where I'm going to be accepted. And by the way, um, I'm a senior in high school, or I'm gonna be at least, I'm 17, so it's about time I started applying to colleges and stuff, <coughs> um, definitely, for, um, I'm, uh, there are gonna be a lot of videos coming up with college, um, on my mind and stuff, um, so, it, just sit, buckle back and do those, um, it's not gonna be like everyone with, like, college, 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 a college I wanna do this, a college I wanna do that, it's not gonna be like that, it, it might be every few videos, though, so just buckle down if you ain't. Uh, good with that, but, uh, someone did want me to make a commentary on what I want my life to be like after college, like, what job I want, or, like, basically how I want my life to tune out. Um, I'll make that video soon, but it won't be this one. I guarantee to have that video done before SG210, so it'll be done in the near future, just watch my SGs and you'll see, it'll, it'll be one of these, so, yeah, I'll promise you that'll be before SG210. Sometimes there's chest over here, and today there is. Oh, a tier two, that's even better. Um, okay, even though I didn't really need a lot of that stuff. Um, dang, I need food and I need a sword. <laughs> I can make an iron one, so as long as no one interrupts me on my way to the top of the mountain, I should be fine. So anyway, I looked at a couple of schools. I found two I liked and, oh no, I found one I liked and two I didn't, uh, which is good. Um, find, going and looking at schools that, um, and finding out that I don't like them isn't a waste of time because it makes me, um... I think sometimes there's a chest at the top of this thing. Let me double check. Um, sometimes it's like inside this, but uh, I guess it's not here for this game. Um, 
Yeah, um, yeah, it's it's useful to know what schools I don't want to apply to, so I don't have that thought in the back of my mind that's like, oh, I didn't look at this school. Maybe it might have been my dream school. I guess I'll never know. At least it gives me closure on schools like, oh, good thing I didn't apply there. I want to like this, this, and that. So that's good. Um, and then I started a two-week summer camp. Uh, I went to a summer camp called Duke Tip, which is basically um, a camp hosted by Duke University where I lived at Duke for two weeks. And it was basically college for two weeks. Um, and I'm going to be straight up honest. It was the best two weeks of my entire life. It was something I needed just for myself so badly. I mean, usually I don't get a lot of breaks in my routines and stuff. Like, my life is very uh, routine for those of you that didn't know. I got school, got rowing. Uh, I sh try to stream at the same times and record videos at the same times. Um, I ha Like, my life is just so booked up. So it was just nice to go to a place where um, it, my schedule was just different to some degree. Um, I mean, it's not like college without the class. I did have class six and a half hours each weekday. And it was only on one subject, but I liked the subject. It was innovations in medical technology. I don't want to be a doctor. I'll talk to more about that in the episode about what I want my job to be. Uh, I don't want to be a doctor, but I do like science. So I found that class to be very fun. Um, if you guys want to know one piece of information I learned there, because if I spent two weeks at SMU camp for academics and didn't learn anything, then I kind of wasted um, whoever paid for the camp, which in this case was my parents. Um, to give you one tidbit of information, they're actually able to 3D print organs now that actually work. I didn't know that was a thing, but apparently uh, we are at that technology. I mean, I knew 3D printing was a thing. Like, one of my friends owns a 3D printer. Um... And he actually printed me off some sunglasses that I need to find. Like the ones with the shades over them. Or the lines or whatever. Um, so yeah, that's cool. But I didn't know we were at the point where like... Uh, we were able to make organs. That's so cool to me. Um, and that's just one of the things I learned while I was there. Um, but anyway, it, 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 I'm, it, I'm stuttering a bit, I know. Um, it felt weird being at a place. But also good being at a place. Where hatred, stress... Being made fun of, none of that existed. And that sounds kind of weird, but none of that existed there. And it was, it was so relieving. Um, at the camp, or like, back in Dallas, I'm not viewed as, uh, I'm not viewed as, like, one of the coolest people or, like, any of that. Like, it's not like I hate myself to the point of depression, but I'm not necessarily the most popular kid. I, um, I don't get every girl I go after. Uh, well, actually, that's kind of true. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Um. I'm just not someone who really is well known for doing a lot of stuff in Dallas, even though I have that. And when I went to the camp, I was easily one of the most liked kids there. I, I probably met more people knew me than I knew people at that camp, probably. Like, just to say, I, it felt different being, like, really popular. And I'm not saying, like, um, I, like, abused any power or anything. I, I was just myself, which was really cool. I gotta be myself. And people liked me, which shows that when I go out to college, this ain't no high school game anymore, ladies and gentlemen. Because I feel like I'm a, uh, I went through some awkward changes my freshman and sophomore year of high school that I kind of ironed out my junior year. So now I feel like I, I like myself a lot better than I used to. Um, I hate this mountain. It's always so confusing to get up to the top. How do I do it? trying to figure it out it's always stressful um and there's crafting bench on top that i gotta get to so anyway uh yeah and i i did everything i wanted to there i had a fun class made some cool friends that i'm still in contact with uh there was a girl there that i kind of liked and she kind of liked me back so it was kind of fun getting to spend time with her um i and th they had athletic of um activities at the night during the night too Found out I'm really good at ultimate frisbee because I'm tall, I can throw a frisbee well, and you don't have to run necessarily that fast to be good at it, but uh, since it was kind of an academic camp, I guess I was one of the more athletic kids there. Um, on a tangent, I, I don't know what made this thought come into my mind here. Let me make an iron sword and then say it. Um, someone always comes into my live streams and says, show me... Wait, did I do this? Because I've, I've failed this recording a few times. Someone always comes into my things and says, show me your abs. I feel like, I feel like I did this already, but if I didn't, here they are again. I've lost a ton of weight because I haven't worked out in two or three, or I haven't worked out in three and a half weeks. 
So anyway, it just felt so relieving being at a place where I could be me and people really liked me. Like, everybody liked me there. I didn't have anyone who was out for me. No one was envious of what I had. No one uh, made me feel bad for what I had or what I did. Um, and it just felt good to have a really clean slate. And I really enjoyed it. And it's definitely not something I take for granted. Um, it's something that really like changed my life in a positive direction um and i i'm so happy i got that opportunity um and i've always thanked my parents for it and whatnot so it's not like i'm some greedy asshole kid not thanking his parents for that fun experience because it was honestly really worth it i'm gonna stay up here until refill because this chest is tier two then i can craft some stuff and then take the jump down but anyway after that i went to the beach um, the beach is not one of my most favorite places on Earth, just because there's not a lot to do there. People are like, oh, summer beach reading is the best, and I'm just there like, eh, it's okay, it's not really that fun. I'm not a big reader. Um, beach reading was kind of not interesting. My internet was really slow, um, up in the condo room where we were at, um... Like, in all honesty, it's not that I didn't appreciate the trip because I did get to spend some decent time with my family. But, um, I feel like I could have given the trip to someone else and both of us would have been happier with that. Does that make sense? Like, it's not like I, w I didn't complain the whole time I was on the trip. I was nice about it. I said thank you for everything I had. And I genuinely did have some fun. But a beach trip is just something that someone who's really stressed out with their life... Um, could probably use a beach trip more than me. I just feel like. So, wasn't really that interesting. Didn't really do anything that cool there. And now I'm back. Um, my SG skills, I've been playing, um, just talking to friends on Skype, catching up with them. My skills aren't dead. Um, I'm still pretty good at SG, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but I'm just getting back into it. I also haven't streamed yet since I got back. I did that, uh, partner stream with Hudson and Matt. Uh, uh, I, was it this recording or another? I, I've done the, I've played on SG3 like three times for this recording. I, I needed a game that was long enough to get through everything. Um, and for those of you that saw that weird stream where Matt and Hudson were here and we tried a three-person stream, that was just, it, it's something I'm glad I tried once. Hudson and Matt aren't, like, the most talkative people, um... So that might account for, like, some of the awkwardness that was going on. It, it was still fun. We had so much fun doing it. Don't get me wrong. Um, and that was the first time I tried streaming on more than one mic. Uh, so for those of you that were complaining about echoing, I'm sorry. It might be something that I try again in the near future. But uh, for now, just most of my streams are going to be solo from the new, or in the near future. Let's just say that. I might try it, like, once or twice again. Um, but... It is what it is, and it's it's something I'm honestly glad that I tried once, just to see how it was. So this chest is about a refill. Let me grab some water. So it just felt, I, in all honesty, July 2015 is probably the greatest month I've had in a long time. It really has been. Um, and that's not to say like, oh, the one month I'm not streaming or doing YouTube, um, was the best month. No, it's not like that. I didn't. Minecraft is a game, I'm gonna be honest, Minecraft is, I don't, I like Minecraft, but I don't, like, love it. Whenever I'm away from my computer, I don't, like, really miss it. It just, I've played so much survival games that at this point, it's just mindless. It's, it just gives me something to do instead of just doing nothing, if that makes sense. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. I, I kicked a hornet's nest, I kicked a hornet's nest. Uh, I got that one person decently low. I don't know how I'm gonna take this uh, fight on. Please tell me this is not the way it's a thousand steps up. But yeah, I don't really crave the game Minecraft um, because it's just such a mindless activity for me these days. Okay, I gotta start adding some jumps. They're gonna be able to hit me. I thought they got rid of these stupid mechanics. Okay, it, yeah, they're gonna get me. There's no way I can make it out of here with all these jumps I gotta make if they can fishing rod me. Um. Okay, gotta make it, make it, make it. Gotta get the gap in there somewhere, but I don't think I'll be able to. Ah, I knew I wouldn't be able to. And once I got out there, there's not... I might have been able to escape from that. But oh well, that was a good first game, so you guys will have some other games to enjoy. But just touching up on that thought, I did miss making content for you guys, and it's good to be back. 
Um, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the episode. So on to game two. And we are back with another round. But this round, I am joined with my friend Charles. Yo. All right. Taco Bell dog said this is the worst map ever. Oh, okay. I actually didn't see that. G player ever. Okay, I'm gonna be going to my usual pink house route. Uh, did you just take spawn or whatever? Oh, oh baby, I got such good gear. Did you I actually? Actually, yeah, I, I have like full iron now. All right, this is for those of you watching my YouTube audience. Uh, from the YouTube audience, this is the first uh game I've recorded <laughs> since my trip. <laughs> I'm getting him, Liam. I'm getting him. <laughs> Do you, what weapon do you have? Stone sword. I just slaughtered this kid. All right. I made my way to pink house. No one's really in the vicinity. I just got to loot this chest in case it has a weapon, which it did. Okay, so I'm going to throw those on. Oh, let me eat that one. Climb down here. Okay. So now that I'm down here, uh, let's get into a topic. What do you want to start off with? Um, let's talk about something we can all agree on. Pol politics. <laughs> No. Uh, um. <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's the whole weirdest cop. Please tell me you did that on Pope. <laughs> one, one weird kid in my uh, science class last year, and he, like during test, he, he was just like a real uh, attention grabber. Um, <laughs> so he would always, like during tests, like he was just going, like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> all right okay um oh geez you might have to guard me for a sec oh i'm looting my stuff searching through my stuff too getting it all nice and organized um yeah i could use each of these i guess yeah someone actually proved to me on a stream um about a month ago oh geez i'm hitting the frame spikes oh well here maybe if Stay. i yeah i'm gonna try hitting up and then start again that kind of worked um, okay, I don't care if it's, like, really that laggy. Um, <laughs> yeah, okay, so anyway, I'm gonna come over here. Um, yeah, someone disproved me on stream a while back. Um, I always thought gold boots were worse than leathers for some reason, because I was told that gold had, uh, less durability than leathers, but that's not true. So leather boots are the worst one. Wait, did you just drop a dime? Oh, that's a chicken. chicken. That, that looked like a diamond on my screen. I'm like, I have a diamond. Wait, do you have a diamond or iron ingot? Let me check. One, two, three. Uh, I have zero. Oh, as a matter of fact. Yeah, you have zero. Yeah, so for the YouTube audience out there, sorry if this game comes out laggy. This is the first time my computer's tried to record a game in a while. I know I have the space on my hard drive for it. I made sure to clear out um, a quarter of my hard drive for this episode. It shouldn't get anywhere near that long, but I had to clear it out. Hey, do you have food? Yeah, I always have food. <laughs> okay, so let's come up here. Okay, I got the second diamond I needed. Um, I also got the boots I needed. Do you know where I am? I'm in that tree in the back. Uh, I'll be back at the river in like 20 seconds, so just let me loot uh, this I, other I, chest. I, 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 <laughs> okay, let's come over here. Um. Okay, Charles. Oh wait, what happened to those boots? Was well, that you? I what put on some. About? I had some Anthony, iron boots. It. I uh, I had some iron boots over here that I put on, uh, but I'm not wearing them, and I threw them out. Here they are. Yeah, some of you probably noticed that. So there we go. They're back on, all nice and snug. Um, yeah, we were actually talking about this earlier, that m some movies don't fit the title. Or, like, oh, pe yeah. people oh, complain... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, pe yeah. People complain yeah. when the movie is worse than the book, and then um, most people's excuses that they can't do everything. Like, oh, the movie can't do everything that the book has. Well, like, yeah, but... Well, if they do nothing, then they yeah. have no right to use the same title. Like, for example, The Lightning Thief. Yeah, for those of you that saw Posty Jackson, The Lightning Thief, I personally loved uh, the Posty Jackson books, and they ruined... Yeah, The the Lightning Thief was awful, and I'm surprised they even got around to the second movie. I mean, which was worse, in my opinion. I didn't see the second like, movie. The first movie. The first movie, I thought it could stand alone on its own. Like, okay, yeah, it's not a, it's not faithful to the book, but it at least could do all right on its own. Yeah, like, like if it had a different title, it could probably have worked. Yeah, but the second movie wasn't faithful, and it was just awful. Kind of like Liam's ex-girlfriend. Oh, I'm kidding. No, Ooh. that's not true Don't at you. all. 
Gotcha. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was, that's not what happened with with his with his ex girlfriend. True. Same. Same. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Anyway, the phrase "same" is just yeah. something Charles got me hooked on saying. It came to me in a dream. Yeah, it came to Charles in a dream. And anyway, at first, when Ch Charles always, uh, whenever I would use the word "same," like in a sentence, like, so I did the same thing today as I did yesterday. You would just go "same." And at first, I thought it was like really no, no, stupid. No, no, not like no, it's like sir. Sir. Yeah, there's different ways to do it and whatnot. And anyway, at first, I thought it was really stupid when he started uh, saying it, but now it like is now a part of my vocabulary. And while I was away at my same. trip, I got <laughs> same. Okay, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll stop. Okay, yeah, I got other people. Um, when I was out. At like summer camping at the beach, so to get other people to use the same lingo, uh, which was kind of funny. Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. You think I could? You don't need any gear, do you? Like iron gear, or whatever. Um, uh, no. I need food and a bow. I'm going to go and carry it on accident. I need a oh bow my too. God. I have food. I have a lot of food. Where are you? Um. Oh, and I'm in like all the leaveless trees. Oh, I know where you are. One thing that um near the power plant. One thing I don't even think I've told you, Charles. Um, but usually with my hair, the first thing, one of the first things I do when I wake up is I put gel in it. But recently, what I've been doing is I put gel on last thing before I go to bed, so I don't have to waste time in the morning doing it. Um. And it actually, like, I didn't think it would hold its shape overnight, but it's been doing a good job. I just took a shower and did it again, uh, because I had to help my friend build a concrete square today, which, by the way, we spent, like, four hours on it, and it's not done, so I appreciate concrete sidewalks a lot more than I used to. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, how many did you do? Just one? Yeah, we did one. There was, like, a sidewalk, um... There was, a built on, like, mass. there was a sidewalk around the field, and there was a sidewalk um, in front of a building, and they weren't connected. So we basically built this, like, plot to, uh, a sidewalk plot to connect the two. I'd say the plot's about, like, eight, no, it's a, probably about, like, 12 feet long by, like, six feet wide. Like, it's it's not that big of a concrete square, but it's still pretty good. And I don't Thank know. You. Thank God. Yeah, I don't Wait, know. Let me show my skin. Oh, yeah, Charles got it. Where'd you go? I'm right here. Oh, I'm right okay. Here. For those of you that have played um, the Batman games, um, th oh, there's a guy around here. Yeah. Yeah, we can kill him later. Am I on Anyways, one point? Yeah, I'm on this, one eight. This is Deathstroke from Arkham Origins. I yeah. think it's pretty cool. I'm getting the. Don't move. I'm getting the complete view with shaders. Yeah, that's Charles' yeah, new skin. Like, put up like a picture of like Deathstroke. Okay, I'll try to remember to edit that in right here, okay? Uh, hopefully I remember to get that in, guys. If I didn't, uh, I'm sorry, but this episode's gonna be a long way. Usually whenever I say, I need to remember to put this in, you, I don't think I've ever messed that up, to be completely honest. I got, I got, oh, I can make you an iron sword. I did get bored enough on my beach trip to the point where I started re-watching some of my old videos again, and some of them actually weren't that bad. Like, usually people look back in their old videos and they're like, Jeez, I can't believe I did that. Um, mm -hmm. do, you have an, do you have an iron sword for me? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, um, but my first videos were actually fine. Charles, I, I've said this on camera before whenever Charles is in my things. But uh, the very first episode, the very first episode I did on Castle Dracula, uh, Charles and I were actually in a Skype call, but I just told Charles to mute. So he heard, the, he heard my first uh, commentary as it was going live. Um, but Charles died early that game, and I didn't see him. But if you look at the tab list, I mean, his username's Charlie Boxel, so you might be able to see it, um, if you pause the video early on. But I think you died pretty quickly in that game, didn't you? Yeah. <coughs> Some guy followed me down the hill, like, just wouldn't stop chasing me. Yeah. Oh, wait. Well, speaking of, here's another topic we can talk about, how MCSG is kind of like... Oh, like, I wanted they, to... They keep adding, like, new maps, and they don't really mean anything. Like, the, the more... The more features Minecraft adds, like, the less creative the builds kind of seem, to me at least. Yeah, I'm- the thing about MCSG I'm gonna save for another, uh, video that I was gonna do, either SG201 or 202. So I'll get to that eventually. But, um, 
Yeah, Minecraft. Oh, wait, why am I coming up here? I don't have anything to enchant. Or any levels to enchant, I should say. Um, But yeah, MC is. Uh, Minecraft is just. At least with 1.9, the end cities. Even though I haven't taken a look at them myself, and I might make a video on that just to explore. Um, I think. I'm, I'm heading back to spawn. Um, I think Minecraft is getting a bit stingy with their updates, to be honest. They aren't doing as much as they used to. Um, did you know at one point they were actually gonna add, uh, gears to Minecraft? Um. Gears? Yeah. Like, you'd place them on walls, like, you know, cogs. Like, they would just turn, and it, like, uh, but no one, I, they didn't release it, and, like, um, but there were videos about it. Like, you can look it up and like they actually had content where the gears were there they just didn't add them i don't know what gears would have done and i think they honestly added redstone just to replace it redstone's the oh, one thing in minecraft i haven't figured out like i know i've, I've somewhat I, figured it out i know pvp i know a lot of the obscure uh crafting recipes i know how to make potions and whatnot but the one thing i can't figure out to save my life is how to uh like, build yeah. redstone creation. Yeah, I can do basic stuff, but, like, not anything big. Like, I don't know what a clock is in redstone. I don't know how to build a oh, clock. Oh, I know how. Um... Not like the item. Not the yellow item that you hold in your hand. Like, oh, it's... build a clock out of redstone. Yeah, like, no. There's, like... There's some device called a clock. Like, you know how... Oh, and... fine. But, like, not, like, an actual redstone. Like, not, like, a the yellow clock example. yeah not the yellow clock that you make with four oh. gold ingots and dust like I'm there's sure if, like i spent long enough like on youtube like i could probably figure it out yeah uh one time i tried in a single player world to build a pulser i think that's what they were called or they still might be called that. i'm not sure oh it's deathmatch time i don't even have a bow i one time built an automatic food dispenser that i kept on creating so it was pretty helpful all right do you have a bow just one uh, why no i don't Okay. Wow. 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 Okay. No. No. No, dude. 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 We'll split it up. Okay. Okay. He didn't have a bow either. Um. Here. Take one flint and steel, and then the rest we honestly don't need. I'd empty out my inventory, but in all honesty, it doesn't really matter because, uh, whoever wins wins. Okay. So, um, you just want to go whenever you don't have a bow either, right? All right. Three, two, one, go. Okay, yeah, gotta focus up. Actually, don't know where you went. Okay. Oh, oh. Hey, you have a diamond sword. There we go. Okay, I had two and a half. I had two and a half. And I didn't use a gap. I had a gap, but I didn't use it until afterward. Did you eat a gap beforehand? Okay, I was just wondering. I didn't think you did. Cheater. All right, but anyway, so there we go. We got to win. Um, I don't think that this is going to be the final round of the thing. So um, I'll see you guys next game. And we are back with the second game of the collab contest. I'm here with my friend, Venetia. Hello. Okay, so let's get going in this game. Um, oh, 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 no. Okay, someone, someone looted a diamond in pants. Wait, go a bit to your left. Go a bit to your left. I'm here. I'm here. Oh, what did I glitch into? Let's go this way. Okay. okay. Um. Oh, someone's already taken my. Oh, they're going like the. They're going a bad way. They're going a bad way. Okay. So you said like we talked about this map a bit. You said you're not that familiar familiar with it or what? I'm not that familiar with this one. Okay. So it looks like I'm. Oh wait. Oh, that's you. I'm like whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were about to be killed because we failed a couple of times. We have um here take these boots, um yeah okay take those. We're gonna be coming up. Uh, this chest is like sometimes good, sometimes bad. So I'm just gonna check it out really quick. Um if you stay on the ground, just watch out for players. I'm gonna be down in about like 30 seconds. Or you're welcome to come up. I mean, that's okay, I'll, I'll stay. I'll stay on the ground. Alright, just make sure, like, try to find, uh, like, a chest that no one's looted and get a weapon. Because right now we're doing awful. Like, none of my chests have been that good this game. Okay. Okay, I got decent stuff. I got decent stuff. It might be use more useful to stack you up before me, I feel like. Um, because you play MCSG a lot less, and plus we're on US connection here. 
Um, okay. wait, okay, where'd you go? Um. Like, just describe your surroundings and I can probably find you. I'm oh, like there you are. Okay, I found you. Nice description. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Let's go <laughs> okay. this way. Wait, did you see where I went off to? Uh, uh okay. I don't so, have a weapon, by the way. Okay, yeah. I, like, uh, all we have is a wood sword. Okay, so, um, do you, oh, did you see the buttery challenge from, like, way back in, oh, no, wait. Hold yeah. on. Yeah. Okay, I've so. All your episodes. Oh, you have? I didn't know yep. that. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, no, wait, you I add boots. Okay, so if I need to use the, so, you know how the, uh, trap works? The one with, uh, if you run through it, you can hit the lever and then the people die? Uh, not familiar with it, but I know of it. Okay, basically what happens is, there's like, since we're inside the castle walls now, how it works is, um, if you're being chased by someone, you run through it, and when they're on the long straight part, you hit the lever, and then it opens up a lava trap. And the lever is close to the interior of the castle. I guess on the map design is supposed to be like, um, when... Like, if someone was trying to invade the castle through that way, uh, they could be killed with that trap. I guess that's the way it was supposed to be. Okay. Okay, uh, let's come over here. Can't find you. Oh, I got a wood sword. I got a wood sword. Okay, found you. Okay. I see you. I, yeah, I'm just, I like, I'm so autopilot here. I've done this map so many times on and off camera. Oh, wait, you could use these. Okay, so I want us to be about, like, even gear. Um, I can make one iron sword. Um, okay, I got a, I got a stone sword. So I'll give you the iron since the stone and iron sword aren't really that much a difference here. Um, there are a few crafting benches nearby. There's actually one inside the bazaar. I've like I've known about this ever since I've started YouTube, but I've never shown it on camera. I don't think or on stream really. If you hit that, it opens up a crafting table right here. Oh, cool. <laughs> okay, so actually no, you take the iron sword. We'll probably get at least one more of those. Um by the time the game ends. Um, do you have a bow? Nope. Okay, I don't either. <laughs> That's one thing we need to get. Alright. Yeah, I need water real quick. Okay. All I gotta remember is since I'm pre-recording this before my trip, I just gotta remember not to do another Survival Kingdom game in my episode. Oh, wait. Take the... Oh, no, wait. Yeah, I have a leather helmet. Yeah. I, there was one in that chest, and I thought you didn't have one. I gotta remember that I can't do another Survival Kingdom recording before I, uh, leave for- ooh, I can't do another Survival Kingdom recording in this episode, that's what I've been trying to say. Yeah. Okay, I got one iron ingot, so one more and then I can get an iron sword. Okay. Okay, this chest usually has some good stuff in it. Um, I had- Pretty decent stuff. I don't need that. It added diamond and a golden apple. Do you need a golden apple? I have two. I haven't got a golden apple. Okay, there you go. Take one. Okay, thanks. Okay, e I typically when I play with friends, I don't stack them evenly at all. So it's kind of weird for me to like actually try to think about how to distribute gear evenly. <laughs> yeah. Um. Okay. So. Um. I might try to find the golden apple in the tree. I'll give that to you as well. I don't really like. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Like I don't really care if we win or lose this game. I mean, of course we're playing to win here, but like it's not that big of a deal if we lose. Um. Okay. I have. Okay. So I have two golden apples though. Are you sure you don't want yeah. one of them? Okay. Um. Let's go this way. Um. Do you see where I went? Went. Um, kind of. You, yeah, like, kind of just exit the field. Okay, there you are. Um, so now we're gonna go get a couple of other chests up here. I'm going to that secret room with all the levers, and then we'll tackle the castle. Oh, there's a guy up here. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna actually gap up this guy. Okay. Okay, I took a lot. Oh, we got him, we got him. Okay. Really yeah, so, so am I. He got me to two hearts. I had to use one of my golden apples. 
Um, oh. Like, if, if he could have gotten me with one more shot, I don't know if he realizes that. Actually, wait. Okay, you take the gold pants. Can you give me your leathers? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Do you have any food? Oh, yeah, I have a ton of food. Um, yeah, If you need money. some, take those, 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 and those. And that. And that's like. A, probably like a third of my food, but that's a lot. <laughs> okay. Okay, so that guy actually had a lot of good gear. Um, yeah. I'm su I'm surprised he didn't kill me. He had the perfect opportunity to. Um, like I was two outs. He just dove off the cliff and then started going for you. And you must have gotten him like one or two hits, I'd say. I mean, and then you like one of us hit him off and then he died. Yeah. Okay, so we took care of that chest. Um, okay, in this room, just leave all the levers and stuff to me. Um, because if... I, I don't know whether or not you know how to do it, but if you don't, and you misclick the lever, the room fills with lava, and then we both die. Okay, so jump through the fire, in the middle there's water beneath it. Okay. 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 Okay, so sweet. One of us can get a diamond sword now. Um, get sword. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Um. Okay, I can also. I also have eight iron ingots and four gold ingots. Do you have an iron or a gold ingot? Nope. Okay, I just want to know. I want to know like what additional gear we could make here. Okay. Okay, so I'm trying to think. What would be best? Um, iron, iron pants would bring me up one armor bar, but a helmet would bring you up. Okay, I think it might like it might be more useful if you give me your golds and then I give you iron pants. That might be the easiest. Okay. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna make the diamond sword and the pants. So let's go with the sword. Okay, and okay, uh, trade pants. And I'm also gonna make some arrows. Do you have a bow yet? Nope. Okay, I might have left one in a chest up there. Uh, we're gonna. Oh wait, I didn't put those back. Um, okay, it's actually really close to death match. Okay, there's a couple chests I want to check out, but then we'll have to like really crank it to get back to spawn. Okay. Okay. So we wait. Did you? Oh, you just a bit behind. So I'm gonna head back up the same way we just did over to the windmill thing. But I'm gonna go inside that castle. Um, I think I had a bow. I think I just left it uh, inside a chest though, because I mean I didn't need it personally, but I forgot to ask you if you needed one. Okay. Oh. Sh and we're coming up, we're coming up, okay. Yeah, okay, so I made it here quicker than I thought I would. We should have enough time to explore the chest I wanted. Okay, yeah, there's a bow in here. Um, you nearby? Oh, uh, oh, oh, okay, there you are, there you are. Um, I don't know if you like using a fishing rod, but there's one over here, too. I'm, I... Out of I mean, I am too. I can't figure it out. And everybody, yeah. like, it seems like the one thing that everybody else uh, got in on, except me. Um, well, when, I it, did. when it comes to MCSG, Hold on, where's the place? I think this is what I like to climb. Okay. Um, we're gonna come up here. You have to climb on that wooden log, and then you climb. Um, you don't look that way. You look toward the cobble block and like if you stand right here and you jump and you look at this If you look oh. that way, then you'll make it it's Pretty weird. Yeah, it's it's weird because of the block uh, the way the blocks work. Yeah, I, should I just get the chest? It's like real yeah. nearby and then I'll be back to you. It's not gonna be like that far away. I'm nearly there. Okay, I made it up here. That chest, ooh, that chest had iron boots. I don't know if you need those or not. And that chest had... Yeah, I do need iron boots. Okay, so at least it wasn't a waste of time coming over you. Okay, so we're going to have to book it if we're going to get to spawn on time. Um, Okay, I'm back to where you were. 
the the boots um behind you behind you okay um so there are the boots okay, okay. let's book it to spawn i'm gonna assume one or two people are gonna be there so if we take them out uh we should win this one okay. and we aren't that far away yeah okay um yeah, do you think there's gonna be anybody there? I mean, refills in a minute. Uh, probably. Yeah, let's see, let's see. Yeah, I don't see anyone initially. Oh, wait, yeah, I do. There's a guy on top of it. Um. Yeah, there's a guy over here. Oh. PvPing like crap today. Okay. Yeah, this guy's gonna be our main competition. Hold on. Okay, I'm here. Okay, I do have a gap. It's probably worth eating now. Okay. This guy's tough. <laughs> I don't like this guy. Like, I don't even know if I could have beat this guy if I was solo. Um, yeah, I'll try to... Uh, the vines keep slowing me down. Okay, I'm gonna try to cut him off this way. He's trying to pull here. Okay, he's he's just kept running this way. I don't know if he's gonna try to make a dash back to spawn or what. I kind of lost him. Oh. Okay, I got three hits on him. Okay, he's he's back at spawn pretty much. Oh no, wait, no, he's not. He's by a fenced off area. I mean, I I know. It, okay, he's near spawn. If you head back over there, he's near it. I think he's running back in okay he's back in the spawn square um so that's where we are okay we okay i died uh. oh he's low he's low Okay, just stay underwater. Stay underwater as you shoot. Ah, dang oh, it. Okay, so that was a pretty fun game we had there. Um, I think that's yeah. the one I'm going to use in the recording. So, uh, I appreciate you coming out and playing with me. It really means a lot. Um, and thanks again for the out. Thanks again for the out. Okay, so, I mean, you're probably going to watch this once it goes live. But for the YouTube audience, I will see you guys in round three. Round four, here we go. For this round, I'm here with my friend, Hudson. Hey, guys. I, it, uh, even though he hasn't been on my channel that much, his in-game name is MayonnaiseMan42. Uh, is that you running off? Uh, yes, I ran off. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, we need to go to the pirate ship. You're running in the exact right direction we need to be going. Just keep going that way. Do you know the route to the pirate ship? Or are you just... Not too much. I'm just All right, go a bit to your left. Go a bit to your left. You see me? I'm, like, kind of behind you. It's, it's gonna be over here. Okay. This is where we need to be. Okay. Okay, there's gonna be stuff inside the ship. I hope this game is 18 minutes, otherwise I gotta go into game 5 here. <laughs> um, okay, but it's SG1, so players aren't gonna really be able to find each other. So I'm gonna come back here. Okay, I got a sword. We got some... Please tell me that's you, that's behind me. I'm on top. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I got good stuff, I got good stuff. Okay, oh, you take fine. that, 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 that. Okay, so now we have... Okay, now we have an even distribution. I'm just trying to get our bearings good. Is the room already open? Hold on. There's a room over here. Um, stay up there. Stay up there. Okay, for just a sec. Um, there might be... Okay, come down. Come down. Um, okay, so now that we have everything um, pretty much to ourselves, we pretty got this game in the bag now. Um, here, don't come in this room or hit any of the buttons or anything. Okay. So now that... Um, so now that we have our game pretty much good to go at this moment, let's get into a topic. So Hudson and I were looking up some video topics beforehand because, to be honest, I'm kind of out of them at this point. Um, and one of them that came up was the safety of the internet. All right, so Hudson, when you were smaller, your parents told you right, like that the the internet's full of creepy people and whatever. Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, every most parents did tell people that just because, like, you don't want your kids searching around on the internet for 
like weird stuff, but in reality, there's not like too many bad people out there on the internet. Yeah. Well, okay. The only things I will say is you shouldn't give out you information to like I, you shouldn't give out you information. But other than that, it's pretty much a safe place. When I was younger, my parents wouldn't let me watch YouTube because they thought uh, it had inappropriate content on it. Yeah, it's, you see, it's not that it has inappropriate content in it, and it is, it's, you have to find the correct content, you know, like, it's, yeah. like it's all bad. And, like, you, YouTube is, like, moderated, so it's not like there's, like, sex and stuff going on on YouTube. Oh, yeah. They censor a lot of good stuff. Well, good because... stuff? <laughs> the good stuff. Okay, so, okay, I got an iron sword, which is good. Um, there's not really any use for you to come up here. Anymore, so I'm just gonna jump this way. Um, I've tried to record on this map. Like, I feel like... Oh, no, I streamed a lot on this map last night. I streamed a lot. I'm getting back into that now that I'm back in town. You already have a sword, right? I gave you a stone one? Yes. Okay, that's good. So, yeah. The internet, um... It's really not that bad of a place. And, it like, um... In, in all honesty, like... I know people know what my real uh, first and last name is. My first name's obviously Liam. That's not like a disguise or anything. Um, but uh, my last name has been leaked here and there. And I don't really care if you know it. Just don't leave it in the description below. But no, honestly, no one's really going to do anything with that information. Like, no, don't let the... Like have your address or anything, you know? Yeah, and my parents were like livid when I told them that on stream I told people that I live in Dallas. It's like... This city has over a million people. They won't find me. And I bet you, like, there's, like, three or four, like, maybe even ten, fifteen people who stream, like, in Dallas, you know? Like, it's not like you're gonna find you. It's been way- I guarantee you, way more than ten people in Dallas stream. Okay, I'm gonna come this way. Um... I need to do this parkour. Oh, no, wait. I forgot. It doesn't give out the good helmet these days. Um... Okay, it might not, okay? Just stand by this water thing over here. It'll open up in a sec when I'm done with this. A lot of people always say that this parkour is extremely difficult. I haven't died on it in a long time. Oh, I almost died. <laughs> I nearly I nearly jumped into the lava. Um, you just gotta get the timing down. Everything goes in groups of four. Okay, so I got everything I needed. Did the water thing give out any piece of armor? Yes, it did. What'd it give you? Just random, like, oh, okay. Um, wait, do you need... No, you don't need any of this, so I'm gonna boom those. Okay. Um, okay, we still got seven people remaining, so this game might actually make the cutoff. I do have a boat! I do not have a boat, but I'm waiting for Hudson. Unless, Hudson, you have a boat? I do not have a boat. Wait, do I have an extra? Yeah, I do have an extra. Here, let's go to this island. Okay, we're... Wait, we... yeah, we're on the 48 version. I forgot, I'm like, are we on the... Which version are we on? Yeah, we're on 48. Okay, so one other thing. Um, oh, I added, like, a list of topics over here. Okay, do you have a curfew? Do you know if you have one or not? Yeah, I have a curfew. Usually it's, like, 11 o'clock or whenever my parents text me, which I have no problem with, just because, you know, like, 11 o'clock's a bit late, but whatever. Um, I, I don't have, like, a specific curfew, but, yeah, my parents will usually just text me to come home by a certain time. I usually am not out past 11 o'clock or midnight, usually. Yeah. Um, that is what it is. Um, Next, but, but in our age, there's nothing really that usually goes on very good at past 11 o'clock. Yeah, so. it really isn't. Uh, okay, I looted everything. We're all good. Um, yeah. So let's go back to spawn and just find people to kill, I guess. Um, when you were younger, what bedtimes did you have? Like, it probably got later the older you got. Yeah, it did get uh, later the older I got, but, like, it, we'll see. As far as back as I remember, it's probably like nine o'clock, maybe, like mm -hmm. when I was in middle school or any something like that, like early to middle school. And then I kept trying to climb it up, like, oh, mom can't make it by thirty, like all that kind of stuff. But like, as as they began to trust me, I got uh, later curfews just because like they know they can trust me when I'm out, or like, no, I they, I need to come home at a certain time, and then they can extend it because they know I'm not going to do anything stupid or bad. Yeah, what, um, what happened with me is I remember my curfew, uh, not, not a curfew, I don't really, I've never really had, like, a set time, I have to be in the house, but, um, I used to have to go to bed by, like, 9.30 in 5th and 6th grade, then I think it was 10 o'clock through 7th and 8th, and then once I got into high school, my parents just said, do whatever the hell you want, pretty much, 
Um, but I kind of just made it 11 o'clock on my own. I mean, sometimes homework gets really intense and I gotta stay up later than that. But like the 11 o'clock thing is something I do for me. Because then you later and I won't be able to stand it. Oh, yeah. Hey, I start getting really tired when it gets like midnight or 1 o'clock. You know, I just yeah. can't stay up that late. Yeah, I used to be so less tired when I was smaller. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I know, me too. Like, so were you about, like, 12 or 13, and then that's when you just started to sleep in a lot more? Oh, yeah. Okay, hold on. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Crouch, crouch, crouch. There are people. Uh, okay, I think... I think I see a team of three. Okay, run, run, run. Oh, I know where to go. Okay, do you have your boat still? No, I don't. Okay, um, what we need to do is we need to go to that thing in the water. Okay, you know that giant lava thing we went to earlier? Yeah. Okay, what we gotta do is we gotta make it over there. We gotta make sure that they're chasing us, though. Okay, what we need to do is we need to get them to chase us, and then we need to go to that lava thing, and once we're there, we'll be able to hit them off. Uh, into the lava. And I've done it before. I don't- I know I've done it at least on stream, and a few times off camera. Don't know if I've done it on video. Wait, where are they? Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, let's go this way. Sprint. Okay. We gotta get out of here. I don't know- are they following us? We gotta, no. we gotta bait the mobu. Yeah, I think they're following us. That's just I don't think they are. Are they not? I don't. I guess they don't. I guess they don't want to bother us or something. Yeah. Okay. Do they? Oh, right okay. There. Right there. Okay. Are they following us now? Yeah, they are. Okay. 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 <laughs> you need your boat, dude. You need it. Did you break it or something? Yeah, I broke it. Okay. Oh gosh, I'm getting hit. Okay, hit. maybe you'll uh, die in this heart, process. Heart, yeah, but I'm dead. Okay, I just gotta make it out alive. Okay, hit me forward, hit me forward. Okay. Okay, I got them. Okay, they're gonna follow, they're gonna follow. Okay, this is so good. Dude, this is gonna be so awesome if it works. Okay, this guy's gonna follow me. <laughs> I can't wait to see this play out. Okay, I know exactly how to do it too. I've done this so many times. This is, like, you gotta just figure out these ways on maps to get people. It's so funny if this is gonna work. Okay. Okay. Okay, I don't know how I only... I didn't take damage there. Okay, is he coming down? Uh, let's see. I think he might be. Uh, he's... He left. Alright, here, I'm gonna shoot him. I need... Uh, I don't have a bow, though. I don't have a bow. Yeah, I need to go up. I need to bait him down here. That's the key. I gotta get him alone down here, and I'll be able to hit him into the lava. Um. Okay, we'll tease him a bit. We'll tease him a bit. Okay. Let's see what he does. Okay, you gave me a bow. Yeah, I'm trying to just tease him a bit to get him back here. Okay. Wish I had a boat still. I think I broke mine. Yeah, you did break yours. Okay, he's not coming. Okay. Wow, I think you yeah, I did hit him there. It got so dug so quick. Okay, fight me. Okay. See what he does. Give me a call from my grandfather. I won't answer it though. I have two gaps, so I'm in. Oh, uh, you got it. He's gonna get away. I'm out of arrows. Shoot. <laughs> Shoot, I'm out of arrows! Okay, Can't I don't. Okay. Okay. Ease. Okay. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, how did that miss? Okay, okay. I've wasted all my arrows again. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go this way. I'm so, I'm focusing so hard on this kill right now. This kid is gonna eat it. Okay, see what he does. I really wish I had my boat still. That would have made that. 
Yeah, I would have had him if I was able to bait him into that he thing. That would have been... Know. That would have been... An... I, I, I kind of know why he probably didn't find that, man. Just because of that reason. Because you'll kill him. Yeah, but, I mean, still. It would have been nice if he had. And I just went through all my gaps, which isn't good. Okay, yeah. he, I need to be able to get back to spawn. I need to cut him off on his way to spawn. That's going to be crucial. Okay, uh -huh. can you get, like, an overhead view since you're dead of him? Wish there weren't, like, three people teaming in one game. Um. Okay, he's. Let's see. I don't he's know where. West. He's heading let's west, see. okay. I don't know where he is, and I don't see him. Okay, just keep he heading west, yeah. like, from the. From, like, so you know what, what direction he headed in the water. But yeah. The water, he just kept heading west. Yeah, I see a behind him, but he can't see anything. He's kind of running back. Yeah, I see a couple of people. How many people would spawn? I think I only see. I see two. Might just try to kill one. They don't see me. Okay, while they're looking in the chest, I'll light him up. Yeah, yeah, light him. Got him. Okay. Oh shoot! I lagged. I lagged so bad in that thing. Okay, oh my god, I gotta get out of here. That that was close. That nearly worked, but I had a huge lag spike as soon as I started wailing on him. Um, okay. Okay, I need... Yeah, I need to head back east. It's this way. I need to go back to the pirate ship. I need to get gaps. I need to get arrows. I gotta get everything again, and hopefully I can take this team out. Okay, so so far this game has been about 14 minutes, so maybe this episode will be longer than an hour, which, I mean, that's fine with me. <sighs> okay, we're gonna come this way, this way, this way. Okay, so they are still trapped. Okay, they would spawn. What, I don't want the three of them to reunite, though, but I feel like that's what's gonna happen. I need boats, I need arrows, I need everything. Okay, I can't believe I wasted those arrows. What did, okay, I, I just want to see what my grandfather needed, but I didn't answer, so it's all good. Okay. Yeah, well, he didn't, like, text saying he needed anything. Okay, we got... Yeah, I need to take out the team, though. I want to save one of the team members for deathmatch. Like, the key to taking out teams is you take them out one by one, and it's fine if you, like, leave just one for deathmatch. Like, I don't want to... I don't want to take all of them out. Okay. That was a decent... Like, that plane worked decently. It, I couldn't light him, though, because he was standing on top of the chest. I had to get him once he landed on the ground. And he, his teammates are lucky that uh, he saw what was happening, because I would have had that guy finished off. Okay. Okay, we'll boom through all that. Okay, I'm, I need a diamond sword. That's another thing I need. So now I have two gaps. I'm gonna just head back on the same old route. I have a boat. Oh, now I got two boats. I got two boats. Um, I can craft some arrows. So things are gonna be starting to look a lot better in a sec here. But unfortunately, all the t all the people at spawn are gonna get. They're gonna have a ton of gaps. Like they're gonna be just as stacked as I am by the time they're done looting that. I'll try to see if I can find you again because I whenever I teleport over something on the mouse, I want to be teleport anybody again. Yeah, the spectator commands suck these days. I hate them. Like, a lot of times I'm not able to get out of somebody's view or whatever, and I can't spectate someone else. I need a fishing rod as well. But most of this route is tier 2, so I'm not going to have much luck finding a rod. Okay. Okay, I got more good stuff. I don't... I'll just put that in there. What can I make? I can make a few arrows. Okay, so now I got 13 arrows. Any of the, any of them, like, separated from the pack? That's going to be the goal. I got to get them when they're separated. I'm trying to see. Let's see. Oh, no. They're back together. They're at spawn. All three of them? Mm -hmm. Dang Actually, it. No, wait, wait, wait. Are these two attacking this guy? Probably no, not. If they're just slapping him around with the fishing rod. Yeah, probably. Okay. Oh, uh, this is so annoying. I don't know how to take these people on. All right, let's go with that. Okay. 
gonna go back to the water we got i'm just doing the whole route again i know i know it's kind of sucky i gotta spend my time doing this but i'm gonna do the whole route again i'm really gonna try to win this game because so far um for the three games i've recorded i won one but lost the other two so i'm gonna try to at least make it two two here okay this is i need to get them in here and then it's my game to lose i oh man okay finally i got uh, a second diamond, so now I'm good. Now I'm a lot better off. Yeah, the thing... What I'm gonna try to do is, for those of you watching... Well, um, when the guy comes down... If they come down, I run across that, I go across that side, and then when they're over there, if they try to run near me, um, what I do is I just shoot them off, and then they fall into the lava and die. That's the way to do it. Uh, you can just, like, slap them, punch them, anything... Uh, sure, I'm vulnerable to shots, but usually most people won't take the shots for some reason. They'll just try to do it the other way. I don't know. I ain't that stupid, though. So, okay, so let's go over here. Oh, my God. these It's that evil... Like, if I could just get one of them, this fight would be a million times easier. My mind's racing at that. Okay, so we just hit the 18-minute mark, which is good. Oh, I broke my boat. I shouldn't have done that. Um, is there a crafting bench still here? Okay, I got a gap and another boat. Just what I needed. What are your coins? Um, negative 1, 2, 50 and negative 300. Okay. Okay. I have not gotten a fishing rod all game. I'll just put these in there. It's, everybody's gonna be stacked by this point, so there's really no boobies. Finally, the sun is coming back up. Okay. Oh, one of them just falls in, like, a lava trap or something who just, like, passes away randomly. Okay. Okay, so I got all my... Oh, there we go. Okay, do you know where they are? Are they just... <sighs> God. I need to get them away from there. That's gonna be my only shot of winning. I gotta get them away from spawn. Okay, let's come over here. Okay, we got the boat. We got the boat. And let's go, okay, we dove in the water, and we're gonna go this way to the dime. Oh, is crafting bench? Crafting bench is up here on the 48 version. Oh, shoot, 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 I didn't want, mean to step on that. I don't even know where the TNT explodes on that. It makes the noise, but I don't know where it explodes or hurts you. It explodes on the button. Okay. Okay. So now I got a diamond sword. So I'm about as good as I'm going to get this game. I got three gaps. I got 22 arrows. is isn't a lot I can do. Oh, that being cast guy that talked, he has nothing. Which guy? The one who talked in the chat. Oh, I didn't see that. I can't... Uh, in MCSG, some people don't know this, but you have to be within a certain range of other people in order for them to be able to read your text. Oh, interesting. I think... Rod Spam, Evil Anvil, and Shadow AEZ. Are those are the three people on the team. Yes. Give them the old stat check. See so yeah, Rod Spam, yeah. Evil Anvil, and Shadow. Uh, Evil Anvil. Oh, Evil Anvil must suck at PvP. He has zero wins for three games. Oh shoot, I'm lagging. I'm at like. One FPS now? Okay. Okay, here, let me refresh the frames because I'm lagging. Okay, now I'm back up to 50, so that's okay, good. they're kind of leaving spawn. I don't know if they see you or something, but... I'm not new spawn yet. They're, I'm... they're heading east. Or... Yeah, they're heading east. Okay, I found one. Oh, yeah, they're up. Okay, I got one. I got one. Oh, no! Damn it! Okay. Alright, so, that's the last one. I can't- Oh my god, at least I took one of them out. It's just I couldn't get out of the trees, that was it. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching SG200. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I worked really hard on this. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Hudson, thank you for joining me. Alright. Alright, good. Uh, so, thank you so much for watching. Wait, what's my outro again? It's been like a month since I've done this. Uh, thank you for watching today's episode of NCSG, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.